Okay, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Today we will uh, discuss on our lecture 3. Okay, the topic for lecture 3 is set. Okay, previously in your SPM level, I know that set already teach in mathematics subject. So here we will discuss what is set in term of discrete mathematics, which is what is set all about. Okay, so the lecture content is set. Uh, it's introduction, knowing about set, the size of the set, power set and Cartesian product. Then the set operation involved the uh, that next, we focus on the set operation. Okay, so as an introduction. Okay, in this lecture, we study the fundamental discrete structure on which all other discrete structure are built, namely the set. Okay, set are used to group object together. The language of set is a mean to, the stu to study such collection in an orga organized fashion. Okay, as an as a definition for set, set is an unordered collection. Okay, meaning that here we have to uh, clear that in set there is no order, which is dia tak tersusun. Okay, and the object in set called element or member of the set. We write A, this is the element of the symbol for element of which is this. Okay, element of. Okay. Uh, a element of A to denote that A is a, an element of the set A while the notation A is not element of A denotes that A is not an element in set A. Okay, for example, here we can write. Okay, mean, uh, okay. for example, uh, one is element of integer okay which is one is one element of set integer z okay so the example for not element which is like okay 1.3 is not element of z it's not integer, right? Okay. Okay. Next is, it is a common for set to be denoted using uppercase letter. Lowercase, lowercase letter are usually used to denote element of set. There are several ways to describe a set. One of the ways is known as roster method. Okay. What is roster method? Which is list all the members of a set when this is possible. We use a notation where all the members of the set are listed between braces. For example, the notation A, B, C, D represent the set with the four elements A, B, C, D. Okay. You understand? Okay, then this is the example. For example, the set B of the vowel in the English alphabet can be written as B is equal to A, E, I, O, U. Okay. Look here. This is the curly bracket. Element of the set will be in the curly bracket and inside it is the element of the particular set. Okay, what is this element and what is this element? Okay, such that, okay, so for example, this B. Okay, we can write A element of B because of A is inside B, set B, right? To denote A is an element of set B. The set O of odd positive integer less than 10. Okay, look at here, which is odd positive integer less than 10. This is the syarat you can to be O to be an element in set O. Okay, can be expressed by O is equal to 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. 
we can write 1 is element of O to denote that 1 is an element of the set O. Think here, how to write the set of all positive integer less than 500 is quite a long list, right? Okay, how can we write it? By using the roster method, okay, use ellipses. Dot, 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 when the general pattern of the element is obvious. For instance, the set of positive integer less than 500 can be denoted by, okay, first we have to uh, list down which is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, then uh, until dot, 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 which is it continuous until 499, which is positive integer less than 500. Okay, so that we already know that this is the set of positive integer less than 500. Okay, other than that is by using set builder notation. What is it? Characterize all those elements in a set by stating the property of the all properties they must be, have to be member. For instance, x Okay, x, x is a positive integer less than 500. Just put a word sentence like this. Okay, we know that we are referring to x. So then, x is a positive integer less than 500. O, specifying the universe as the set of positive integer s. Okay, x, okay, O, we can write it as x is element of z positive integer positive. And less than 500. Okay. How to write the set of even positive integer less than 500 by using the roster method? Okay, how can we write it? Roster method. Roster method just now, which is we have to list down even, which is genap, kan? Okay, so kita list down lah. Genap dia, maksudnya genap less than positive integer. Eh? Positive integer, it's begin with 1. But here is even. Which is, it's begin with 2, 4, 6, 8, until what you want to do it. And the, the final one is, what is it? 8, then the final one is 4. A, A. Uh, this is the list of by using the roster method. Set builder notation. Okay, for example, here. Then, like this. Okay, so it is. Okay, we can represent it as X. Okay, kalau kita nak nyatakan dia sebagai X pun boleh. Okay, so yang ni pun X lah juga. X sama juga dengan. Okay, this is the curly bracket. And X. Okay, so here X is the set of even positive integer less than 500, then put it the sentence here, then close the curly bracket. Okay. That's how we represent a roster and build the notation. Okay, next is, okay, here, the following set play an important role in discrete mathematics, which is, okay, this is like we learn in real number for calculus previously, which is N for symbol for natural number, it's including zero until infinity. Okay, one, one, what is it? Then note that some people do not consider zero natural number, so careful to check how the term natural number is used when you read other book. Okay, then, Z is integer. Okay, then Z plus positive integer. This is how we write. Okay, remember the rooster method just now, dot, 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 meaning that it will continuous. Okay, so here Q. Q is rational number. This is how we do by using the, what, we call it just now, build the notation, which is P is element of Z and Q is element of Z also and Q is not equal to zero. Then this is the rational number. Then R is real number. R prime is positive real number and C is a complex number. Okay. Recall the notation of interval of real number. When A, B are real number, A is less than B. We write it as. Okay. This is the notation previously we learned, right? Which is. Yang uh, bracket petak ni meaning that 
dia termasuk which is less or equal less or equal but if it's uh, half uh, half circle this is meaning that is less only but it is not equal it's less only for this okay like this which is is not include a but it includes b because for the b it is a square bracket and for the last one which is it is not include a and also is not include b and what is two here two is a nota kaki nota which is rujukan kat bawah ha, it's called a cross interval and three like this is called a open interval okay easy right okay what is the empty set or null set empty set meaning that there is no element in that particular set or we can uh, denoted as this or this singleton set meaning is a set with one element only a common error is to confuse <coughs> between empty set and this okay with the set which are singleton set okay the single element of the set here is the empty set itself okay then equal set what is it two set are equal if and only if they have the same element therefore if a b are set then a and b are equal like this for all x then x is element of a and it is true if and only if for x is element of b okay we write a is equal to b if a b are equal set even though the order is not the same like this one three five three five one but element there they have the same element okay so we can conclude that this set a is equal to set b okay the, the order in the which the element of a set are listed does not matter tak kisah order dia tak kisah asalkan setiap satu element tu ada di kedua-dua tempat it also does not matter if an element is more than once maksudnya dia berulang pun kita tak kisah asalkan dia ada element tersebut okay knowing about set mix of element okay like this okay this is the mix of element four element each which uh, is a set the four element in this set are natural number integer a uh, rational number and real number okay what is subset it is common to encounter situation where the element of one set are also the element of second set. The subset A is a subset B if and only if. I'm so sorry, yeah. Hello. Tengah record, tapi kita po ah kita dah pause. Ah. <laughs> Uh, okay. So here is a common encounter situation where the set of are uh, also element of the second set. The set A is subset of B if on an if every element of A is also element of B. For example, here A element of A must be inside B. Okay. That what we call as a subset to show that A is subset for B. If X belong to A, then X belong to B. To show that A is not subset of B, find X is element of A such that X is not element of B. For example, the set of odd positive integer less than 10 is a subset of all positive integer less than 10. Okay, all odd positive integer. Okay, meaning that macam semua nombor ganjil positif ni is subset for semua nombor positif yang lebih kecil daripada 10. The set of rational number is subset of real number because of rational number inside the real number here. Okay, oh. next. Okay, here. One way to illustrate set 
in this Venn diagram. Venn diagram can be used to illustrate the set A is a subset of B as shown in figure 1. Okay, figure 1 Venn diagram, for example here, Venn diagram A is inside B, which is A is subset for B. To show that two set A are equal, show that A is subset of B and B is also subset for a, this is for case if A and B are equal, then this rule must be mesti dipatuhi. Okay. This. Okay, the size of set. Okay, this is what we call cardinality. Let S be a set if there are exactly N distinct elements in S where n is a non-negative integer, we say that S is finite set and that, that n is the cardinality of S. Okay, for example here, okay, let A be set odd positive integer less than 10. Okay, A is all the element of odd positive integer. Then cardinality for A is five. Okay, let S be a set of letter in English alphabet. Okay, then cardinality for S is 26. Okay, what is the cardinality of null set? Hmm. Kalau null set, dia tak ada kan? So, the cardinality is size dia berapa? Kosong lah. Size dia kosong. Dia tak ada. Null. Okay. Power set. Give a set of S, then the power set uh, is denoted by PS here. The power set of 0, 1, 2 is the all the subset of 0, 1, 2. Okay, what is the 4 here? The, the reference node, which is the empty set and set itself are member of this subset, meaning that every power set of each uh, element must contain of Null set and itself. Okay, maksudnya set to itself. Okay, for example here, dia ada, kalau dia punya semua power set ni, which is semua subset dia mesti ada. Mesti kosong pun subset dia, satu pun subset dia, dua, kosong satu, kosong dua, satu dua dan kosong satu dua. Okay, okay kat sini kosong dua, dua kosong takkan ada eh, sebab kosong dua, dua kosong kita punya turutan tu tak tak ada. Maksudnya dia kosong dua, dua kosong sama je. Okay, here Cartesian product. Let A, B be a set. The Cartesian product of A and B denoted by A multiplied by B. Okay, what does it mean? Okay, Cartesian product are not equal. Which is A times B is not equal to B times A. Unless A is null and B is null. So, A times B is null and A is equal to B. Okay, now, what does a uh, Cartesian product means okay here A times B which is A element of A um, and this is the conjunction of N B is element of B what is the Cartesian product of A A is 1 2 and B is 1 A B C so Cartesian product for this is 1 A for first element 1 B for second element and 1C for third. Okay, then 2A, 2B, and 2C for the third element. Okay, this is what we call A times B. Okay. Okay, set operation here. Two or more set can be combined in many different ways, which is union, intersection, disjoint, complement. Okay, what is union? Union is uh, A union B, which is A, B. Is the set contain those elements that either A or in B or in both. Okay, so here, uh, this tell us that X element of A, this is, Union, which is all A, X, element of B. This is how the representation of Venn diagram. Okay, now this is intersection, which is persilangan. A, intersection of B. And this uh, bring the N 
properties which is x is element of a and x also a uh, is element of b okay x x element of b here okay which is is share the same element okay which is, is what we call intersection okay then this join meaning that this is not dia tidak bersilang sama sekali which is a bersilang b sama juga dengan empty set tak ada bersilangan okay for here is combining union okay so here we have union which is a times b minus a uh, intersection with b okay Intersection, combining union, intersection and disjoint. Tell us that this. That is, if A element, uh, A intersection with B is uh, null, then A union B is equal to A times B. Okay, this is the Venn diagram of disjoint set. Okay, this is, tampak tak dia tidak bersilang. So, A times B, persilangan dia is null set. Tiada unsur yang bersilang, which is null here. Okay, here. Difference. What is the difference? Macam tolak lah. Maksudnya, we have A minus B, meaning that we have set A, then we tolak semua, kita tak ambil set yang ada B. Okay, so it remain A itself only. Here, this is what we call difference. What is complement? Which is... Uh, a complement which is di luar A. The symbol of complement like this. Yang macam ni. Dia ada topi bergaris lurus kat atas. Horizontal topi kat atas tu. This the complement of A with respect to U. Union. Okay. Semua alat semesta ni kan. Therefore the complement of set A is union minus A. Okay. Tell us that this is the uh, just now the notation. Okay, this is the Venn diagram and this is the set identity, it's content of identity law, domination law, important law, complementation law and commutative law. And this is also the law for the set which is associative, distributive, absorption, De Morgan's law and complement law. What do you, if you want to prove it, you can do a Venn diagram for the left side and Venn diagram for the right side. Then you can prove that these two sides are same. Like this, absorption law. For this, please draw a, a Venn diagram. Then you can prove that it equal to A only. Okay, then we have covered all the uh, 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 this lecture content then next week we will go for the function okay thank you assalamualaikum